scissors. Even though it's not, but uh, yeah. Do I keep this to beat? Um... You keep this to keep fast watch post. Oh, it's a rogue, Tim. Oh, it wasn't that bad, I don't think, Randomer. Hmm. That's kind of awkward. Double tradable. This is very bad. Ooh, double trade over could have sound zero mana wild Paul Kevin. This is a pretty ideal start for them, but it looks like no null unless they're holding the null, which is weird. I have a lot of wind chills. Short stream, I believe today. Let me see. What am I going? Let me see how long my bike ride is. Oh, I'll just tempo this. Wait, what? Shit, I was checking something and then I didn't see that I'm about to die. <laughs> this is uh, rather unfortunate. Okay. Um, hmm. I just have to hit a freaking. I can't really go this because then I have to use coin. So. I mean, if we top deck Stoneful Guardian, we're still in the game. If we don't top deck Stoneful Guardian, it's probably over. But yeah. How are you today? I'm doing all right. What, what did I do today? I should have worked out. Played some Path. Um, uh, ate some food. Hmm. How can I possibly win here? So I can go double wind chill frostbite trade and take basically three. So I guess I do that. Hmm. Alright. I think I might as well coin this out. Because this increases the chance that I hit a... Um, this increases the chance of... Ooh. Okay. I need to hit... Snowfall, I think. I might be able... Do I ever get a clear with the... Maybe I should have just gone for the Flurg out right to begin. Yeah. Okay, I'm done. This is rough.
Top 69, I know. I, know. I, I don't feel like changing the name of my stream from yesterday, though. Because that's work. Just keep it the same here. It's like risky scamper without armor smith. Dude, no, it's more like four girl with toxfin is like if risky skip with armor smith just gained you 20 armor for one proc, you know? How is Glug Silence working over teacher? Uh fine. 22 and 14. It's pretty good. Yeah, I mean it's a it's a it's like a month away from the new expansion. Mm. What am I even supposed to do here? I want to cycle. I could gain a ridiculous amount of, um, I don't know, discounts. Uh, I could also be excited. <laughs> It's weird that the Silver Badge Patriarch is such a legend out there. Hmm. That's kind of a good turn. Ooh, I just kept making more shit. <laughs> now they just go with title customer, but or this. But that was I feel like that was decent. I don't know. I generated a lot of value. The value. Anyways. So <laughs> you're at ag over a lot. And alright. Mm. The the oh, all right. I need to draw birdie and then we can eat their hand. Maybe. I don't know. 
I mean, this life tap might have been short-sighted, but I'm not sure. Dude, are they ever going to use their coin? Dude, they're saving coin for next game. Hmm. Mm, what Murloc do I love in my deck? Just Gorlock, Ravager, and Cookie. All right. Um... Was Priest Hero Power better? Uh, maybe. I didn't see it. I just saw the Warlock Hero Power. Nice, Tom. Wait, you're not Tom Holland or you are Tom Holland? Ooh, only if I had pick and spell here. I could have used that health. Am I about to get wrecked here? Oh, coin five drop. Oh, uh, this asshole. What am I supposed to do here other than die? This is this is so much damage, honestly. I think I'm a goner here. I think I gotta eat some some dudes. I don't know, this is probably dumb. Do you think I can reach legend with Mech Paladin? Um, I don't know you. So let's say. Do I think uh, if you are a person who thinks about how they play the game and uh, adjusts and, and corrects and thinks about the game, can you, uh, a typical person who does that, can they make legend very easily with Mech Paladin? Now, maybe you just spam button clicks like people play Street Fighter. And somehow that's gotten you to diamond. I don't know. But you definitely could. If you're a typical person and you, you who thinks about the game. Would you... So that means just like, all right, wh why did I win this game? Why did I lose this game? What do I do more of? What do I do less of? You start thinking, if you just kind of play cards and then blame bad luck, uh, you, you might not ever get to legend with any deck. So... <laughs> I know I supposed to play this is like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm watching you on the side. Nice. I, I was never good at Street Fighter, but that's how I played it. So I would just spam button clicks. And uh you know what I actually really game I really liked? Uh Super Puzzle Fighter. Uh sure. Did you ever play that game where it's like the the algorithm is tough did it all right here's the secret to beating the algorithm you just gotta like say great things about my man bobby kodak and the game gives you more luck so you know just do a <laughs> the best. did she say bobby is the man did uh, i wish i was as cool as bobby bam easy good luck Hmm. And their hand sucks, so that's good for us. They haven't played any boars. Dude, the great. But you spelled his name wrong, so he's going to think you're drunk. You know? Right. Don't really have many good plays here, so let's just do block minion here. Ha, <laughs> 
Wow, they're so F to your chat, right? Do I go face here or do I not go face? I think I should just play this. I could wait a turn. Um, they haven't done anything. I feel like they have, they have to go Zarella. Like they look like they're trying to go Zarella. Like what's in their hand? They could do a pyro play, but they just use their North Shore. So I think I'm just going to pass here and not go face. That means I can do more damage next turn potentially. All right, they do have a pyro play. Okay, but I can kill this pretty easily. They ah, they have another North Shore. Son of a gun, chat. Hmm. See if they get the zero mana, dude. Hmm. This looks bad, chat. Ooh, that's really good though, right? I just go... Do I have a clear clear on this? Do so I go Pyro, or a Bulner, which is Clownfish, this, this... I think I do. Do I have more Murlocs in my deck? I do not. Let's take Sir Finley then. I have an Amalgam. That's not that. That's just one Murloc. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what you got here. Oh, did I just set myself up for Zarellus? I probably did. Damn. It's actually the problem with going face there with this guy. Uh, I could have had the Bolner live here. All right, um, what do I do? How do I win this game? I think I'm F chat. I guess I can eat something of importance. So I think I go for that. Um, hmm. That's pretty big. I'm going to kit build this because they're going to kill it anyway, so. What is the best deck to climb from Legend, Lie Diamond to Legend? All right. So we're going to go Meta, Diamond 4 to 1, Beast Hunter, Face Hunter, Murloc Shaman, Fell DH. Those are the best ones. And Big Spell Mage, so. Mech Paladin, uh. Not as high up there. Now, the best, the best deck for you as an individual might be different. What you're asking is like, what is the best food to eat? Um, that's a tough question sometimes. Now we can look at the pleasure that lots of people get from food and try and devise that, but it can be tough. All right, what do I do here?
Oh wait, I hit this, so that's good. Pyro? Got it! Ooh, that's huge. They still have a Shadow Devourer though, so I could lose this still. I could frostbite my own minion here, but I don't really think it's worth it here. I'm gonna do this, because then I can get more damage from the next turn if they don't kill these. Seems good. And if they. I think it's too soon for them to get the Shower Devour play. That goes boom 50 face then. Yeah, I told you. Uh, Big Beast Hunter and Face Hunter. Those are the, uh, the, those are the highest win rate decks at Diamond. Now, like I said. Yep. All right. Mm. Ooh, am I about to lose? Oh, they got chat. They got there with four cards left. Oh, that's so bad. It's actually so close here, too. So I have 17 on board. And if I had done the Frostbite play, I we might have won this. There might not have enough mana, but now I lose. So I guess I can... Tr no, I can't kill this off, right? Yeah. I guess I should have killed all their minions. I don't know. It seems reasonable, my play, but... I guess I once I hit the macaw, I could have just cleared their minions and then set up a an unclearable board, and then I would have the life steal. I think that was the better play. So, damn, I think I could have won that. But I... Lady Vox, the best thrall. Fear the coming storm. Your time is mm. I feel like I should keep Snowfall. Guardian, it's like so key in the matchup. Is there any big changes or nerfs around? I'm afraid to risk it with Dust. Now they did just do giant nerfs. But there's an expansion coming up. Um, unfortunately, Hearthstone in 2022. They might nerf a deck just because they decide uh, people don't like it, even if it's not a good deck. So unfortunately, uh, if you're not willing to risk Dusk, you just got to quit the game. That's the bad news. So, sorry about that. But, uh, yeah. Ooh, I could deny them their weapon here, but that seems like a very incorrect play in a Snowfall Guardian matchup, so... August. So... Dude, he does plastic. Uh, you know, if I were in the wrong mood, I'd be annoyed. But but yeah, is uh this is this is a a discount form where you can get his questions answered. So there are days uh where I would uh tell people they can't ask questions like this, and then they uh they would get mad at me and go shit talk me. So. They basically, 
So now uh, this question is, this stream is basically a random question stream, so. I don't think the meta is bad. It's, uh, I'm sad. I'm, s I'm a little sad that it more, not that the meta is bad, but more that, um, that, uh, so many great decks were wrongfully destroyed, but that is not bad. Mm. Oh, they're burnless. I gotta be more careful. I could die. So, I have a uh, starfish ready to go if they do another freezy, though. Troll warrior is back. Yeah, I mean, it's it's sure. More freezy boy. I'm one off lethal here, which really sucks. Twelve, thirteen. 17 yeah it really sucks actually um so i have to decide like do i play the snowfall guardian here instead i might be a snowfall guardian and pray because i i could do i but i mean actually stealth uh this is actually pretty good i just have to trade do a thousand trades which is really annoying, but I think this is actually the best play. The over trades of the century. But now if they go another Snowball Guardian. So like they don't have bioluminescence plays now, so it's harder for them to win. I still have like a ton of damage on board. So and I can get get a little bit extra with Flurgle. What's your favorite color and why did <laughs> to plastic pl did I actually don't believe in colors. Uh so I think uh I think uh colors were uh are a conspiracy, right? Made by uh the the deep state or what I what is it or the Illuminati? I don't understand a lot of the I mean I do obviously. They but <laughs> Color blind. Alright. Alright. Well, I have one play. And I hope they don't have, um... I mean, this is a lot of stats. Which is unfortunate. 
Okay. Not dead, right? We take a good amount of damage off the board here. I have threading 31. Like, I might still win here. They dead chat? Wait, what are they doing? Wait! It goes twice? What? Oh, I'm, I got F to your chat. Did this witness the scam? Chap. I don't know why I did oh that's some bullshit. Should be it should be random. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just complaining for the sake of complaining. Dude, I that's that's I think the the big crayola, big crayon. Um Do you believe in the algorithm? Oh yeah. Like Dude, remember, you get better. I, I clearly have not been saying enough positive things about Bobby because my luck has been pretty bad this stream. So I just want to say, Bobby, you're a great guy. All right. Your time ends now. I mean, I just want to like the timeless truth that the thing that my opponent did to beat me was bullshit. All right. Because, okay. Fundamental truth, chat. One fundamental truth. I should have won that game and every game. Fundamental truth. Fundamental truth too. My opponent stopped me from winning that game by doing something. So therefore, that doing something was fundamentally bullshit. Does that make sense, chat? Is that clear? Yes, exactly, Jet Black, right? Hmm. Imagine if you top deck that instead. Probably go command over wild paw because there's just so much stats. Mm, actually, I think I do command because then oof, I get wrecked by alignment, though, but it is what it is. You can go wild paw next turn. Innervate alignment's a very sad day for me, but I do push 13, so. Wow, did I fuck myself there? I did fuck myself. Wow, I fucked myself so hard there, chat. I can't even blame my opponent there. Because I was the one. Oh, that, I fucked myself so hard that there. That's so embarrassingly bad. I didn't think of, like, well, I just wasn't thinking people run spammy. I forget about that. Ugh. All I had to do is trade off that one one, and we won this game. A nice eat. It's actually a very nice eat. <clears throat> All right. Way too dank. I know, right? Plastic.
I don't run brand, but yeah, Bulner would probably win. Bulner Macaw is insane. Dude, uh, go watch. There's a bunch of YouTube videos on the top decks. Just go watch one of those. That's what I recommend. Hmm. Like literally I've seen like eight. Ooh, a nice eat chat. A nice eat. Could have done a different order actually. Ooh, let's let's do this. I don't really have anything good to Bulner. Gorlock Ravager's tempo and it's more stuff. Brucon's like really nice though if they go alignment. I think I want the Brucon here. Oh wait, I have Mild Paw, so yeah, it's always Brucon. Alright, I think we might win here. Chat, I, I'm glad that with my fundamental skill, I uh, have come back in this game, despite my opponent's fundamental luck. Am I right? Dude, it was. We had two clutch eats so far this game. Mm, they're regretting their decision. As they see I have one off lethal here. Mm. Oh, okay, that's pretty good play. Damn. Wait. These dragon hits were questionable, I'm not gonna lie. They could have gotten one more kill. Alright, how much damage do I do with this bad boy? Alright, let's. Wait, you see my mouse just spam out there for a second? Do I really want to have weapon hood here? I don't think I do. I guess, yeah, like six damage doesn't... Wait, do I have any Murlocs in my hand? I don't. Hmm. I think I'll keep it. Do I have lethal here? I do have lethal, right? Oh, I just go stealthy, or yeah, I have super lethal. Dum, dum, dum. Another, another one bites the dust.
It was a Lyme Druid, but... Gamba? Dude, we don't have any mods here, so... No Gamba. I'm not gonna do it. Ooh, actual rogue, chat. Dude, when you actually play just a straight-up rogue, it's always really confusing. Ooh, good hand, chat. Yeah, silence for the frickin' stealthy boys. And I got, I've got a turn three wild paw, so it's gonna hard for them to get good weapon value. I'm about to take a million damage here, chat. Oh, dude. Uh, this is like a million damage, chat. Like, I swear. Did you see how much damage they did to me? Chat, like, what the hell was this? Chat, all they need is like five damage. Like, one more mind proc and they win. Wait, what? Chat, what is going on? Mm, do I ever. Mm, I think I. I think I prefer wind chilling this. All right. We probably have lethal next turn if they can't kill us, and we can we can get through the taunt if they. All right. <laughs> the demon suit. No! Oh, they're frozen. Oh, wait. Oh, that doesn't do it. It doesn't do it, chat. Because they don't have the damage. Chat, this, dude, easiest game of my life, chat. Man, dude. It... My turn two play might have won us the game, chat, because um, my turn two play denied two damage from that one three, right? <laughs> uh, hitting you for 24, bold strategy. We'll see how it works out for them. Why is it is it not top 420 legend dude? I don't know what's the misunderstanding. Right?
Why Glug? Uh, it's supposedly good enough. It's a good. It's, I mean, why why a clownfish? You know. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, what you got, did? What you got, Chris Talks? Dude, cookie on three into freaking. I could freeze it and deny them the thing, but um, I feel like um, I want to go Gorlack Ravager really badly next turn, so. Well, that's annoying. So annoying, actually. Dude, they, they held this. Oh, this is so bad. We're actually about to lose very badly. Right. Well, I get to draw some cards at least. We gotta play for like Snowfall Guardian win condition, I feel like now. I don't understand why they hate on other decks. So human beings are on a central level like saying the other people are bad and we are good. Uh, now in certain things it actually matters, but we can see it's so primal that you know when we we do it with our sports team with our decks those priests are bad people not like me the, the shaman a good person you know so uh it's very common and it's it's pervasive in our world so if you uh... <clears throat> Chat, being tolerant and accepting is not the norm. Uh, you know, the norm is fuck that other person, you know? So. No noble creature that freezes the bad people. People who pay less mana than they should for the beasts are bad. Dude, exactly, Randomer.
Oh god, another harpoon gun. Hmm, order? I don't know if that's a good order or not. I guess their bottom of their deck sucks, but... Chat, I'm getting crushed over here. Dude, exactly, Darth. Therefore, you are righteously... Righteously justified in your uh, in your hate and uh, of them, right? Look, you're just speaking the truth, right? All right. Um... Do I ever win here? Does Brucon get me there? It might get me there, actually. Wow, we actually have a chance. Wait, you run Royal Librarian? You a jerk? Wait, ah, uh, my opponent's an asshole. But it's actually kind of five, but I think they put the, the, the King Crush at the bottom of their deck. Or... They don't, I mean, you don't, yeah. You know, they don't need to give me an advantage with an informational advantage, you know? We be playing board pretty soon? Probably not. Probably not. I I feel like I've broken up with board priest with the with the new expansion, but snowfall guardian. I want. I have I have a week till masters tour, and I have to decide if I would want to spend all that time playing board priest when I kind of need to be on top of the most up-to-date decks and get a finish, so it's not really a good choice. For <laughs> reason I see you today. <laughs> it's not me, it's you. Meet a boar priest. Um, you're just not terribly important to me. Never bring a
Can you choose the song in the background? Uh, no, you can't. Um. Now that I hit War Leader, I don't go for the Mutinous Winning Condition. I go for, um, I think War Leader the Winning Condition here. We often just have Lethal here. Such choices. Get him. Fast. Mm, I don't know if this player is actually playing Druidic.
Hello, cast. Scrappy with trash. All right, Mutanus changes my plays. We go fast Mutanus next turn, and then we go Macaw. <clears throat> Ooh, I kind of want to go Wild Paw because my Mutanus will literally be zero mana. If they go alignment here, so. But, uh. I guess that has its downsides because I just float a mana. I guess I can go. Oh, I go Frostbite on my own minion. Okay, so. I go Mutanus for zero and I go Frostbite on my two, three. And you rack them here. We got, uh. Okay. Ooh. Wait, I could just block minion here, chat, right? And then, wait, no, I can't block. I guess, no, I could just block minion here. And they can't play Anaconda, but then they can go spell. So I think, okay, I think I'll still stick with, stick with the original plan here. Alright, I did. Wait, Anaconda doesn't even work. They play Anaconda. I think that's game. They're just shut out here. They're just completely shut out. With the frostbite there. Oh, gosh. No, it doesn't do it, though. Because they can't. They just can't. They can't get a spell down here. Wow, that just kind of auto wins the game there. Dude, witness the skill chat. Witness... Yeah, it's pretty easy to wreck them with this deck.
Yeah, why can't I top deck like a Murloc here? It's annoying. Um, I don't, oh, I guess Frostbite's actually really good here, right? Like super annoying for them. I can push like a ton of damage with schooling next turn potentially, but it's hard for them to do any sort of pyro play. I could block minion with blade master next turn too for cookie. I don't know. Try uh, what do people run? Try a uh, chain lightning. It's kind of a catch-all uh, replacement in this deck. Mm. Ooh, this looks like desperation, chat. I think we win here. The one mana spell, maybe? One mana spell is what they need here, right? Hey. Good. They've only played one spell. This is a game, right? I guess they look for a zero mana spell here. Uh, some heals. Oh. Tell me you know. Wow, that is a wower, man. They're in a really bad spot. Hmm. Oh, chat, you ready to see this lethal? Witness the lethaling skill, chat. That was actually such a sick lethal. Witness the lethaling skill. Dude. <laughs> chat, I woke up this morning and I was like, how am I so good at this game? <laughs> Get in my belly! Come on! Oh, good hand chat. Double wild pause a lot, but we have the schoolings for early board control. How do you lift weights? Um, I I use gloves, uh, but I used to when my hands are really bad. I would, uh, you ever see those things that people dangle on from like a pull up bar and then do ab workouts? I, I would wrap those around my, my elbows so I could do like, uh, I could do a lot of stuff with that. 
Um, and that's kind of how I would, uh, but that was, but then once I got, uh, my hands have been doing a lot better for the last three years. Um, so since like 2019, so I can lift with the gloves again, but So I never get legend. Dude, you know what's the unfortunate truth for you people like you during this year? If you're good at the game, like any meta, like any deck that shows up on HS replay, you probably can get legend with. That's the sad thing about Hearthstone that like you can technically win with anything, which I'm sick of. Like I want, I, 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 I've been saying this for years, Blizzard needs to make the game so only a few decks can win. It's bullshit that people can just win with anything, you know, if they're good at the game. Another doggy biscuit, you jerk. Mm. Oh, this is actually... Mm, this looks bad. Am I gonna die? I don't wanna die, chat! Not like this, chat. Not like this. Wait, I'm just dead. Alright, well. Chat, I, I think that, uh... So, Blizzard should just make certain decks OP. And... They should make some decks just bad. And if you want the better deck, you have to spend like way more money than you currently are. Like I'm, I'm amazed that people can like free to play this game. I think that's a big problem, you know? Like, I think you should have to pay like a thousand dollars for the best deck and then you just beat everybody. And except maybe like you occasionally lose the second best deck, you know? Like, Legendary should just be objectively powerful, not like, so, you know? I don't know why this is controversial. Oh, dude, exactly. Like, at least Blizzard's learning, all right? First... <laughs> Young, thank you so much for the Prime Gaming. Get on that stuff, Trey. Thank you so much, Young. This Blade Master is going to be insane, actually. <laughs> That's true, yeah. And like, Blizzard can just make cards super OP, so... Because here's the problem. Great deck builders like myself, they might go go out and ruin it by like actually making a meta breaker that doesn't need like a billion dust. I think that's a big issue, you know? Ooh. 
I can just tempo this bad boy. Hmm. It's gonna be a big old burning acolyte, champ. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Like, yeah. How about this? Like your, your life is low. So they give you a notification like, Hey, your life's looking a little low. Would you like to pay two ninety nine to gain some more life? You know? I think that would be really good. You know, like, and then you, you have to decide like, cause that way, if you you think your opponent's a real jerk, you you can deny them the victory, you know? I think that's a good thing. And why wouldn't that be a good thing, chat? I don't even understand why anyone would disagree with that. This is a lot of minions. Uh... <laughs> well, uh, I mean, like we get, we have to keep the game's integrity, Fatal Vindicator, right? So, I think that's uh, that's. I don't. I'm not sure if that works. You know, it's a respectable game, chat. You know. Hopefully I'm not dead here through like these dudes. <laughs> Dude, I agree. All right, so I have 25. So if I can get, get through these, um, so let's see. I have nine, 12, 14 on board. So, and I have six, 12 here, so. 14 plus 12 is 26. This is 24. So currently I should have a, a lethal here. Wait. Wait, what? Oh. Chat, what is happening? I did not expect this, chat. I uh, did not expect double humongous owl. Wait, what? Wait, do I win still? I might still win here. All right, nine, okay, nine, 15, nine plus 15, uh, 12 plus nine. Does that get through all these? 12 plus nine, oh no, no, it doesn't. Dang, um, 12 plus nine, yeah, it doesn't get there. I think I still do that play though. I don't really like any of my other plays, like Galug, I wanna, I wanna get the heal here. Ah, it seems good enough. <laughs> I 
my first poor child. Uh, did it did. Uh, I don't know. Like, is your fatal vindicate? Is your first four child still a virgin? Because when we, I know they go firstborn childs go for the most when they're virgins, right? <laughs> Chad, that's such a fucked up joke. Please. <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't help myself, Chad. It was too hilarious. Oh Chad, I'm too off lethal here. Uh am I gonna lose here? Dude, I might lose. I don't have two damage. I could go for Discover Fire Elemental. That's actually, you know, um, uh, I don't. Yeah, I guess I can get Cookie killed, likely. Okay. Wait, it's random enemy. It could go to the same one twice, so. Sometimes we get lethal here, chat. Witness the skill. <laughs> chat, I didn't actually see that out. Good, good out to look for, chat. Witness the skill. Yeah, it was a good out. Chat, dude, 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 dude chat. Everybody uh, congratulate uh, Doomrex. Guy just got here, did witness the skill. It was actually, it was mainly Doomrex, but I executed the skill, so. Oh, crap, man. Running it up to top ten tonight? Probably not pocket train. I'm going to I'm going sex Colton. Do you think I should keep Brucon against Paladin? I think I'm going to actually. So it's a shorter stream. Chad, I'm addicted to the sex cult lifestyle, you know? Didn't go yet? No, no. Sex cult is mainly a night thing, though occasionally it has there are some day sex cults, but I don't usually frequent them, so. To see you climb faster. Yeah, well, I, I, I think I'm still in top 50, so, like, well, I think my, my plan, Pocket Train, is I just I, I, I just keep playing on America until I'm 10 higher on America than Asia, then I switch to Asia, and I just keep going back and forth on that. And I think uh, variants and, like, even if I'm not a... I, in theory, I'm, I'm a good player, but in practice, who knows? But when you, I will eventually get positive variants, you know. So, uh, so yeah. Really, it's not too heavy. Mm. I think I go triple this and put the the pressure on here. No, nope. this might have been dumb actually. They don't really want to go pyro here, though, after they do this, though, right? So... I think I actually don't play the Amalgam next turn. I play the Gorlack because I want to get the, the potential discounts. Ooh, we already drew Mitanis. I don't think I actually want to rush a Mutanus out. I don't think I'm going to play. Like, here's the thing about rushing Mutanus out. It's like, 
I want to get it with Macaw, you know, so. Doesn't seem right to rush out Mutanus, right? Seems like a mistake. Wait, are they going to wreck me here? Yes. <laughs> they kind of just wrecked me, chat. But it's a cost of doing business, you know? You know, Anz, we realized we can't actually do Watchstone this month. Oh, because of uh, Masters Tour, right? Yeah, I kind of thought about that. And I was like, yeah, I don't think it's going to work myself, but yeah. It was fun last month. Well, well, it'll happen eventually again. My parents are in town that week in Denim, so it's like I should be spending my spare time with them anyways, so... What do I do here? Actually, I think I'd rather have another elemental here. Which spell does this draw me? Ooh, I could get like a command. Uh, I think I take the piranha. This is like nice for for taking down annoying pyromancers, dude. Do my parents appreciate that I do this? Do my parents? Okay, here's what they want from me. They want me to be able to pay my own bills and they want me to reproduce. So if I can convince them that I still have a chance at reproducing, uh, they'll be happy with this, all right? That's really all they want, so. How many Murlocs do I have left in my deck? Oh, just two, right? Uh, but I don't really uh, like overdrawing. Uh, Bolner is so good later, but I think I play... I think it's a slow matchup. I don't think I rush it. Dude, exactly, tiny little one. You understand. Such choices. Dude, it's going great, dude. Uh, yeah. The chat. All right. There's actually a. There's actually a. You can't even. There's actually somebody in the Hearthstone community that I see. Um, I'm not going to give it too much information, but I, I saw that they're also involved in their own uh, sex cult. Um, yeah. They're, they're a lot more open about it um, than I am. But yeah, so I thought that was interesting. Hmm. Such choices. Dude, the, dude, it's so dude, it's so true. Maybe I don't know. It's but it, it surprised me. It it showed up on my uh, um. They had a uh, they had uh yeah. It, they they posted about something about it. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, wow. I didn't. I they're they're much more open. I'm I'm not going on Twitter on my sex cult lifestyle. Just sharing it on Twitch chat, of course. Uh, but yeah, so. Does it create an ultimate god gamer? That basically it combines your MMR. That's why it's like really important if you want to have a a great like a great a high MMR like child. You got like if you're this is if you're me and I'm like you know trying to date a woman. I really gotta like you know question her about her her skill you know and make sure she had a, a you know. And she, she vice versa, you know, she doesn't, she wants, you know, so it's, it's, it's tough out there, you know? Oh, dude, 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 they're going to be a powerhouse to Jamin. Powerhouse couple.
Chad, I'm keeping my Murloc, my Murlocs discounts because I can go Bulner plus Mutanus and then like eat their whole hand eventually. <laughs> so I'm being very careful not to, um, not to play. Um, you don't want to be playing. Um, what's it called? Any Murlocs here, basically. Yep, we just need to draw Macaw, and then we can, we literally will eat everything. We'll eat four minions, it's going to be ridiculous. That should win the game, especially when we have upgraded hero power, like we just outvalue them. <laughs> always spend your mana, all right? Yeah. I, I think if you, if you could teach a player the always spend your mana, like always value trade, um, and always play minions, they can get to, they might be able to get to legend. They could easily get the diamond with that logic, you know, spend your mana, play minions, take value trades, but hmm. wait, what, what is this nonsense play chat? This play was so questionable because now I. Like, I could eat their hand, but I'm just gonna frickin' do silencey boy here, you know? Surprised they did that play, but they're kind of getting ro ro annihilated here. They have to pull off some really five head play to win. I feel like, because all right, what you got, Matt P? Hmm. So if they the five head play might be do nothing. All right, I think it's I th is it time to eat chat? Ooh, do I have a clear here? Oh, chat, I'm I'm one off, right? Oh, wait, okay. The shaman deck is fun. It's growing on me. It's a fun deck. Chad, this this meta is redeemable. Come back. I know, right? Chad, I literally held back tempo for Yeah, I mean I'm just gonna like eat their whole hand and it's gonna like I mean I think they yeah, I think like the Brucon hero power but like and they know I've drawn so many cards, so now that every other game isn't box mage. Wait, why is box mage calming down? Do I keep this?
Ooh, they can make me overdraw, which is very annoying. Chat, actual warlock or rogue? I don't I don't even know. Like they're playing it kind of like a rogue. They haven't played any warlock cards yet. But... They don't have any kept cards, so they could just be fishing for Wildpaw. Do we not smork with the piranhas? Uh, we could have gone one two on turn two. It might have been better. It's actually probably better pocket train, because then if they didn't do anything, I could push nine the next turn. No result respecting rogue. I never got this skin, but. Hmm. Chad, do they have a good punish for me going three piranhas here? What's their punish for me going three piranhas? Like, do they don't have a good way to deal one to all except that one mana spell, right? Because then I could do a lot of damage, right? Curse Warlock. Like, they don't have a good way to deal, the, to kill off all my 1-1s, one right? Mortal Coils? Mortal Coils are actually pretty good. Yeah. Do I just play it slow here, and then? I don't know. Let's just, let's just play it. Yeah. Well, I also can just... Let's just go double Clownfish, then. It's good. To, it's, I, I just wanted to put as much pressure into, into their turn five because their turn six is when they clear. So. I mean, they drew so many cards and I put so little pressure in the first few turns. So. You know, ironically, chat. This hand is super easy to dump. It's like actually such an easy to dump hand, which is kind of interesting. I'll leave the stream. Glug, Glug goes, uh, okay, dang. That's annoying. Hmm, I could have used him. All right, I guess we get ready for Glug. All right. Oh, that that animation's actually so sick. Like it's burning up. That's actually kind of sick. Chef, we're trying to bait out the removal, so then I go Glug and we win the game. Hopefully. Wait, why did they Mortal Coil first, chat? 
This is oh, they're going six drop. Oh, six drop doesn't actually work here, chat. Because um, they're clearly going uh, hero card, but like they, they, they don't have a spell that kills this first. They're gonna get wrecked here. Ah, they have a drain soul. Yeah, jerk. All right, I think I lose. Chad, am I about to die? I feel like I'm about to die. Chad Black! <laughs> Thank you, Justice for Gluck. Get on that stuff, Tran. Thank you so much, Chad Black. Bye bye. How many Murlocs do I have in my deck right now? One, two, not that three. Okay. So I could draw with Gorlack, maybe get a Frostbite off, and then go for a Mutanus win condition with Bolner. That might work. Are you playing this deck? This deck is about a 30% against Curse Lock. Not very good. How do you have a positive win rate against Warlock? Because I'm so good at this game. That's how. Chat, I did write Art of the Scam, all right? Ooh, do I just go in here? Dude, chat, I'm going in. No dilly dallying around here. There's an Ashara. Let's let's get a, a Cursey boy here, like a Curse Five. Ooh, and a Gigafit. Get in the belly. Get in the belly. Like like what I just did. I eat their win condition, get a bunch of stats, and then hope they can't kill me with curses. So the way you win with Curse Lock. It's not by clearing, uh, it's getting the curses down. I know that sounds obvious, but like a lot of players will just, uh, weaker players, you can win pretty easily because they don't put enough pressure to curse you. But my opponent's about to win here because I'm not going to be able to stop all these curses. Like, I uh, wait, I'm just dead. I'm just freaking dead, chat. All right, well, yeah. So... But if your opponent like keeps on just removing and not doing their curses, you will win this matchup, basically. Curses! Clug died for nothing.
Hmm. Sure, I kind of want to keep uh, the boner here. This is. A fast boner versus a. Ooh, now I can just go for. Maybe I just don't play boner here because I can. Draw my Mutanus and then win pretty easily with that. Got rank one. Yeah. You really can't trust the Jay Huang meta because you don't know how much he's cheating. Uh, so, I mean, dude, even Blyze hasn't held rank one for as long as Mr. Huang. So, even if you think he's a good player, which I do. Uh, you know, if, you, if you're, if you're just an average top 100 level player and you just cheat as much as you possibly can, you're going to get number one legend, you know, cause you can see, like, you can literally play decks that are exploitative where you get to see their hands. So. He's just stream snipes. So. Very well. He he got banned for it, so nothing nothing that crazy. And he also shares information with people, so. He's not cheating. He's just really good at the game. And then he wouldn't need to cheat, Johnny. Uh, look, it's it's uh, it's not it's his. It's his decision to destroy his uh, competitive reputation through cheating, all right? Um, he is a good player, though. But am I going to say am I gonna say anyone is the best player when they're so well-known to be cheating or a top player? Probably not. Uh, you know, and I've, uh, he, apparently he sniped Oon a bunch recently, so, uh, you know. So, you know, yep. So, they're, they're just better stuff because they're willing to cheat. I mean, yeah, maybe that's the way they look at it, you know? I mean, you know, Bernie Madoff was just good at capitalism, right? <laughs> he was just playing the game, chat, you know? My man Bernie. Do I draw six cards here or... Nah, I wanna, I wanna, it's Paladin. I want to go for Mutanus win condition. Just such an easy way to win. All right, we got him. I mean, people like his content. He's he's actually a, he's he's a good content creator. He's fun, you know. He streams good at like long hours. He's uh, you know, you know, and people like toxic content, you know. So it's like, it's it's fun, you know. Like people like it. But if you're gonna say if you want to go around saying someone's the best player, 
uh, they gotta have a, they gotta be not cheating on the regular basis, you know? So. Like when, like he'll even cheat his friends. It's, it's, he's very much the no honor amongst thieves kind of per thing, you know? So, so. Well, pe people, so there's certain, like, it's an interesting thing of uh, they're like the uh, wanting to win at any cost. Um, but there are certain things that are just not going to get punished that much. Uh, with rules, they get punished with reputation. So, I need mana. oh, I'm overloaded. This sucks. So no urge to have an advantage. Yeah. I mean, like, here's the thing. You're not, it's going to be very difficult for you to cheat in a tournament. Uh, there are ways that people have, but, and also like, uh, but it's going to be much more difficult. There are ways like sharing information, but at the end of the day, to win a tournament, you got to be a great player and that's hard to do. Um, so, um, mm. Ooh, let's free go freezy boy here. Actually, I don't know go glug here. I like glug better. They're almost all unbelievably bad. Yeah, so like, you know, it's it's a thing of uh Yeah. That's uh so you then you sunder well how good are they really if their if their tournament records really bad um you know and it, it could be a cool thing of like if you have the the lack of cell control and the lack of like ability to like hang in there and fight that you always feel you need to cheat when you're playing uh that it makes sense like you he might just be unresilient to those matchups so so yeah, blood sacrifices, satanic temple. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of also like, there's gray areas. Um, Blizzard, you know, cause like, I I, I didn't like the whole, um, what's it called? The whole freaking like bug stuff because I don't think it's player's responsibility to, to um, I don't think it should be the player's responsibility to be on top of like, what are the bugged cards? And like these book cards aren't, Let's see if this the scams him here. No, oh, dang it. Okay. Ooh. Shit, I'm playing this game so weird. <laughs> but I could literally bolner a million freaking bolners here. They last, champ. Yeah, I mean it's just like, did like. Even like there, he's freaking 18, 19, uh, and he doesn't know as good as he should, you know. There, there, there are there are there are old people who do this same shit, but they're usually more crafty about it because they've. Uh, but yeah, like they're not as like open and blazing. So, but you know. Hmm. 
All right. To the public, pays them nothing for beta testing. Yeah. So if they're going to do that, they should just, like, not give people shit when, like, when random people are like, oh, I'm going to exploit bioluminescence. You know, like, if, if they are going to do that, they should just say, hey, bioluminescence is bugged. Everybody have fun. You know, have fun. It'll be fixed in two days. Like, that's what I think they should have done. Not like, hey, all you guys are technically uh, doing a bannable offense, which is what they did. Uh, so, like... They just say, hey, uh, you know, it'd be nice if people didn't do this, but everybody's doing it, so feel free to play it, you know, like. Like, if you're going to go with, if you're going to be a cheater simp, I guess, it's that term, just like, at the end of the day, it's, it's a children's car. Like, it's not a big deal, really, but it's still something, you know, but it, you're, it's not really that big a deal for the most part, like... Ooh, that is a big freaking minion chat. Holy crap. Holy crap, that is a big ass minion. All right. Um, they're playing it well here because they've recognized. All right. All right, let's see if we can get through next turn. Yeah, so I mean, yeah. It's, it's, um, one of the things you learn to not cheat is I can get the thing I want the hard way. So, um, you know, let's say, you know, part of the reason you cheat is you think you can't get number one legend without cheating. Um, and when you, if you don't cheat, you say, I am, I am smart enough. I am crafty enough to get the thing I want without, without doing something unethical, uh, which is, you know, life is tough. So I understand, like, I understand that it's difficult. Wait, I just, did I just dirty high roll them for the top deck? I kind of did. All right. All right. If they go equality, the good news is that I can, um, I might have lethal next turn. He doesn't need it, honestly. I mean, so like, like I said, he's a good player, but if you want to have people respect you as a top player, if you want people to respect you as a top player, Hadrian. Oh yeah, yeah. If you want people to respect you as a top player, you need to have a never cheating reputation, because we don't know, you know. So. He's that good, I know, right? But it's it's weird the level of like, I I I I don't hate Jay, like uh, you know. Like he's a fun, he can be a fun guy, you know, fun guy. <laughs> um. Wait, did I just fuck myself over chat? I might have, wait, oh, I have. I think I fucked this turn up really badly. I fucked this turn up so badly, Chad. This was actually really hard. Did I still get there? Oh, wait. 
Chat. Fucked up. Win anyways. Got him. So. Yeah. Well, yeah, you shouldn't Spartan E. So that's what I'm saying is people are trying to say he's a top player and he hasn't earned that. Uh, he has to have a... He has to completely change his rep. Like, if he wants to be a toxic little shit, but but he doesn't cheat, people will gain respect for him because a lot of people don't care about that. They care about, is he good? But if he's cheating, even at all, he's not going to get respect as a top player except by a few players. But, so... But uh, yeah, I did. Like I said, he's 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 a good content creator. Uh, he's he, it's it's a fun stream, and pe so yeah, that too, pocket train. So mm. oh wait, okay, okay, don't keep. Mm. So. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. I I sniped Raiden once, but he deserved it. I mean, uh, <laughs> it's it, it's like I'm not gonna tell like. Lecture you guys on like what 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 people deserve and the blah blah blah. I'm I'm talking about, you know, yeah. It's like I said at the end of the day, sniping, in the grand scheme of world things, events, not a big deal. All right, it's still annoying. It's still like mostly wrong, uh, but like if you had to snipe someone to save the world, I would say that's not wrong. But I think people are just sniping because it's easier, you know. Sniping is always wrong. Uh, I mean, uh, what about like... <laughs> what about like... Okay. Um, there's, a, there's, there's a guy in your room and he's, he's got you and your mom. All right. And he says, if you don't win this game against this streamer, who is also like a toxic little shit, let's say, he's going, he's going to... He's going to, you know, he's, 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 got, he's going to kill your mom. Do you snipe? Obviously, you snipe in that scenario, all right? Like, I mean, at least that's what I think, so still wrong. Oh, no! Oh, I threw, I threw, Chad. I pressed the wrong one. Ah, I misclicked. Instant bottom, right? <laughs> Wait, what? Chad, why isn't my opponent doing things? Why didn't they clear here? Okay. Dude, that might be true, Jedim. <laughs> no, holy no. <laughs> So, so yeah, remember like at the end of the day, it's, there's like the, there's very little, you know, like, what, well, why do you want a high rank? Like there's no money reward in high rank. There is in tournaments uh, and there is the, the proc. So there is cheating to get high rank, but the primary reward you get from getting a high rank is that you flex that you're a really, really good player. All right. Exactly. Exactly. All right. So if you cheat, then you've shown that we can't trust that we can't trust that metric because you cheat. You know? So I just want one person to call you Jiga Chad. Yeah, if I'd gone clownfish the previous turn, I'd go mutinous there, eat their pyro and win the game. So it feels bad, man. I threw that game, but that play.
High people watch, yeah. I can blow a Bolner three, and then this will go down to three, right? If I can hit another Murloc. I also could do, yeah, just this next turn, and then set up for Bolner five. I guess it's not, yeah, so. Yeah. I mean, people, so, use, so... People use, and rightfully so, they use your rank as, okay, how do, how do players know if someone is good at the game or not? Now, really, really good players who have a really deep understanding of the game can sometimes watch a player and say, oh, I see what they're doing. My understanding of the game knows that they're good. So even maybe they're losing, you might know that they're a good player. But that's really, really good players. Yeah, so most of us, if you do not have a deep understanding of the game, what do you do? You look at the person's rank. You say, this person has a high rank. I want to learn how to play this game. I'm going to watch them, you know? Makes sense. Like, it's very, it's very logical. Now, sometimes it's incorrect. Um, you know, there's a lot of other reasons a player could be high ranked other than skill, but there's going to be extremely high correlation with rank and skill, so... There's a pyro. Okay, now they can't kill off their boars very easily. And there's a North Shore, right? I mean, yeah, they've used both their shared. Door. <laughs> North Shore. <laughs> I can do that. That's easy. I can do that if I play. I mean, they can. Um, now, I forget though. I forget that like I actually am talented at Hearthstone, but I don't think I'm that talented. I think I'm just like, don't get me wrong. I'm definitely more talented than the average player person. But what separates me from the most players is that I focused on it. I built habits. I worked on it, you know, and I continue to work on it which is something anyone can do, you know? So like maybe like are, if you're going to be like, or we got our own pocket train or Bly's level, uh, you know, an absolute elite of the game. Oh shit, chat. Wait, they, they pulled this off. Wait, I can go wild paw. Does the wild paw win here? Hmm. They have silence, right? But I get multiple. I get multiple wild paws. But uh, I don't know. What's the play here? Oh God! So I can eat. What do they have? Any minions left? They have a handmaiden, right? Trade. Oh, trade Bulner and Frostbite it. Oh yeah, dude. Pocket train winning the game for me. Yeah, it's over if I do that. It's just over. Dude, thank you, Pocket Train, for allowing me to win for free. <laughs> it's over. I guess they can go face four turns in a row. Isn't that cheating? Uh, it is in the gray area, Grim Shotter. Uh, but uh, does that really win? Uh, yes. 
Oh, um, we might eventually have to play a card. I guess I should clear off some of their, wait. No, no, I don't probably, I wonder if I'm supposed to clear off their, no, they're just, let's see if they, if they ping my face, then I clear off some of their boars. If they don't, I don't, so. Let's see if they ping my face or if they ping one of their boars here. If they ping one of their boars, I probably go double piranha because it's going to take them like four turns to get this, you know? Actually, it still might be, ugh. Problem is they, uh, I still might lose actually. But the reality is if, if I don't listen, like there's a reason why in Master Two, in Master Two or qualifiers, ooh, oh shit, I can just win with Snowfall Guardians. Dude, let's go. Wait, their silence only kills their own minions. So this looks like a win shot. Well, I can go Wildpaw Cavern and Snowfall Guardian. That seems better because then I get the Freezy Boys. Ooh, and then I can block a spell next turn. Yeah, so if they go Silence, if I freeze their face, then then um, the weapon is now useless. And then I can block a spell too. Yeah, so there's, they're doing this. Let's see if they have another spell here, chat. Ooh. Uh, do I still lose here sometimes? Wait, I have the uh, cookie, but I don't know. Wait. I still think I lose. Wait. No, I can go Glog, maybe. Wait, what are they doing? Oh, okay. Alright, this should be a win. I'm wondering if I kill everything off here and then play Glog. Because, like... What do I do here? Fuck. Um, I can play these. I, I can clear... I guess I clear off all their 1-1s one and then they can't do the 1 damage. And then I play the Glog and that's probably a win. So, and I push 11 here. Full face should win. I don't know why full face wins. They just trade off one of their boars. Oh, they, oh, they have to trade off all their boars. I see what you're saying. I don't know. I'm scared of some bullshit, so I'm going to do this. Because now they're one-off lethal, so I think I win always. I don't know. And I have a taunt. I think this is a win. I'm trying to think of what lines could ever... They've used Zarella, right? Like, Oh, they have another silence? No, that's still, still a win, right? Yeah, okay. One-off lethal here, right? Yeah. I, I feel like... I don't know. Okay, yeah. Got him. Uh. Dude, dude, it really did soul love death. <laughs> oh, nice. Chad, dude, 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 they're all they're all the Reddit being like, I just think Vor Priest weapons should do sixteen damage, not fifteen. Who's with me?
Oh, good game. I could have won that. Yeah, it was a, uh, it was an interesting one because it's like that's what's uh depending on Mutanis. I think you play. I you did a really good like your good pyro play. I messed up. I accidentally played the two drop lucid, uh, because I could have gotten Mutanis on five, but maybe, and then eaten your pyro or your North Shore and probably won, but it was uh. But yeah, I don't know. Like I, I think I, I think towards the end, I think I had you because like you'd use, but unless you had some like weird tech. Yeah, yeah, I misclicked. So I could have played the clown, and then I had birdie in hand too. So. So. Yeah, what's that key? I should, dude. Pocket trade did give me some help. A line I didn't see. So I, it's it's. So, where's <laughs> that a little more? <laughs> Dude. Do I ever keep the cookie just to like tempo it out and like. Unpopular opinion, board, did, board priest. I think it should deal. I think it just should, should do 500 damage. Yeah, dude, that's why I'm like. Mm. Ooh, chat. Why is it always a rogue? You jerk. Wait, what? What a jerk move, chat. This is a jerk move. There's nothing more to say about it. Mm. Alright, now I wanna keep um I wanna keep coin. Cause then I can um snowfall guardian a turn earlier. Go wild paw next turn. <laughs> <laughs> I actually think when you get when you when you get hit with the weapon, you should like lose a random legendary from your collection. And this is to go even further beyond. Yeah, I well, no, no, I, 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 because I don't like that pocket train. Because then, well, where does Blizzard gain? You know, so I wanted to take when you're legendary, so then you're more likely to buy more cards. So that like helps the economy and creates jobs. So I think that's really good. You know, who's with me? Chat, witness the skill over here. Witness the skill. Chat, dude, I woke up today and I was like, how am I so good at this game? Do I have any more Murlocs to draw? I do, I guess. Let's draw the Mutanus here. <laughs> Five more dollars for this whole game. Blizzard gets half, player gets the other half. Yeah, yeah, just like Twitch Prime. Yeah, like st to take one off the, the, the Bezos playbook. That seems completely reasonable.
I don't know how anyone would think that's not reasonable even, you know, like what's, what's not reasonable about like, you know, so. Ooh, wait, they're a test gamer over there? Chad, like, do I ever get punished? Like, what's the punish for just all facing? I feel like I just want to all face here. Man, like, maybe I'll okay, trade off one minion and then... I, do I make board space? Like, what do I do with the other? I can still run stab, yeah, yeah. Maybe I just do some, some tr shitty trades here. Make some board space, you know? Get get value out of my cards. Why didn't I kill the wild Paul Null there? That was dumb. Yeah, let's do it anyways. Ooh, more mutanuses. Chad, that's one of those spots where you have to like try and figure out what's the most likely scam, you know? Hmm. You've heard Amalgam for Totem for Pat Piranhas? Uh, dude, yeah, dude, Amalgam Totem is actually, I think, a really underrated play. Um, you know, the, the Flame Ton Totem is a good card. Uh, for Nugget the Margarita, dude. My, Dude, I had I had two margaritas uh out with some friends a couple of weeks ago. And I think it cost me 30 30 like it was like $34. It was rough. Chad, I've realized like the biggest reason not to drink is Yeah, it was like I don't know. But it was kind of fun, so ugh, but like I I'm pretty good at being uh i i have to like i i have like uh, from my so my my dad is very like uh doesn't waste money you know never had like a big fancy car where my my older brother's my half brother and his side of the family is much more like you know they'll go gamble they'll go you know spend the nice money so it's like weird finding the balance 
between like what's wasting money and what's just being cheap, you know, and like, like if I'm out with friends, I, sh you know, relaxing and spending a little money can be good, you know, but yeah, everything is stupidly expensive. So I have to also remember like, I don't know, inflation. Yeah. Inflation is really bad. Ooh, quest hunter. I had even like Ooh, chat. Can I just go wait? Does their deck run minions? Like what what is their deck run? Does it run minions? Can I just go for Macaw win condition? Well, the thing is you might still be able to make it Chat, let me find a quest warrior list. Like, should I... Is Mutanus ever a good play against Quest Hunter? Or are they just like a thousand spells and no minions? Quest Hunter. Okay, I found a list. Oh, they run things like uh, Kotobane. Um, and they run uh, Kotobane and, the, and Viper. Okay, some run Mancrick. Uh, there's a very good chance I don't hit any minions, though. So, it's a tough one. But like, what am I? I also said Paladin is the best deck. Everyone thinks it sucks. It's it's a weird one. It's um, Paladin missed one hundred percent of the shots I don't take. But all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and eat the eat the good one before they can play it here. Wait, what the heck was that card? I don't even know what that card was. I actually did bad placement here, but whatever. Wait, Flame Totem used to be a zero three. I know, right, Mojo? Play Quest DH Counter Curse Log. <laughs> Those snipers, Jay. Did, 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 I don't know. <laughs> I won't even watch that movie American Sniper because I don't want to support sniping in any way, all right? Even...
<laughs> pew pew. Ooh, they can't get Tavish down here. Are they gonna die here? Am I gonna die here? Did, did Flame Tongue Totem indeed carrying? If they can't set up a two turn lethal, I feel like we win hard here. I mean, but oh, this is a very strong play. This is a very strong play, chat. They just did everything here. Okay. So I can freeze and go Brucon next turn, which is like a very strong play. So I feel like we win with that line. Wow, they, they cleared the whole board. That's very impressive. Chip, maybe I just go for uh, value win condition. I was going to do six, but I think I just go two, three taunts and heal. Like, that's just so effing safe. Like, they have two cards. I have Snowfall Guardians. Like, how do I lose with this line, you know? They've already used one Furious Howl, so they only got one more of those, you know? But yeah, I, I'm I'm not sure. I, yeah, I I didn't do well with it on ladder, but I was also playing lots of big spell mage. So it's a thing of like, um, but yeah, it it uh, I think it beats all. It sort of beats all the non greedy decks. Wait, am I about to get wrecked by this? I'm just about to get wrecked here. It's actually so bad. Oh. That was a close one, chat. City Builder, thanks so much for the six months. Get on that sub train, thank you so much, City Builder. Witness the top decking skill, chat. It also could just top deck Dominion. So, okay, chat, let's look at all the good top decks. Schooling was a good top deck. Amalgam was a good top deck. Bolner was a good top deck. Fire versus Sleep Breaker. Macaw, Clownfish, Cookie. Uh, so Wild Paul Cavern was the only bad top deck and Gorlock Ravager. So we honestly should expect to get lucky there most of the time. Mm. It's probably Explosive Trap, right? I don't think we go Glug yet. Or I guess we could go Glug. Glug is probably winning, right? I can go Glug and trade even. All right, whatever. Wait, shit, chat. What was I doing there? Ah, this is chat. I can't lose this game, right? I was thinking I would, I would see what the secret was. <laughs> but. They have Hal here. That tracking. Mm. 
Oh, they got how? No. I still might outvalue them with just Brute Kind Hero Power, but. Chat, if they go another Hero Power, it ends up not mattering, so that's good. Chat, chat, it wouldn't have mattered, see? I knew it wouldn't have mattered, so I give my opponent a false sense of hope. That's a very common play I do. Where I make my opponent think I'm misplaying, but I've calculated so far ahead that I know I can never lose. Wait, am I gonna lose here? Oh my god. Wait. Oh. Chad, do I uh, freeze bird or do I freeze elemental? Freeze bird or freeze elemental? Elemental, I feel like. All right, chat. Chad, well, I gotta see what what time is the Masters Tour? Chad, Pocket Tour. Does anyone know what time the Master Tour starts on Friday? I'm wondering if I can go sex culting on Thursday night. Okay, here we go. All right, June June thirtieth. Wait, C-E-S-T, dude. C-E-S-T is so confusing. Wait, does it start on Thursday? 11-15? Wait. It starts on Thursday. That's so annoying, actually. Ah, dude, that's my that's my favorite sex cold night. Friday morning, Asia. Yeah. Maybe I'll just lose really quickly. Wait, it's Thursday. Okay, so I see it as it says it might starts check in is at um so twelve fifteen a.m. CST. Beef. Uh, 
Wait, they're playing Quest over there? Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna drop. I'm not actually gonna drop, but I'm like... I'm wondering what time it's, uh, start. So, okay, it starts at... All right, it starts at... So, 5.15. So, it'd be... Um, 5.15 the previous day, so yeah, I probably... Mm. That was a pretty good call to grade, by the way. <laughs> yeah looks like no sex cult this week feels bad man Let's oh, screw it. I don't need this card. Could have just drawn the clownfish, but I don't know if I want to play clownfish here yet, so. <laughs> we don't see that every day. A jock steals the. Uh... I think it's better to play Blade Master in the late turns. Then block a three drop. It's much better to block a five, six drop. It kind of ruins their whole turn. Wait, they're doing that here? That's surprising. Okay. Hmm. I can push a lot of damage here if I use the Frostbite. Could also just throw away this. And then I get Blade Master down, but or I can get another Wild Paw, which is nice to get that continuous value stream. Nice mojo. This blocks Whirlpool, which makes things annoying for them. They wanted to, they might have wanted to go Whirlpool here. No, they can't. GG, Maldre. Temple King, you too hard. It was an interesting game. It was, uh... Dude, how did they get another Najak chat? Wait, they're silencing my board here? Oh, chat, I, I allow them to get it. Ooh, big mistake by me. Not really, it's fine. All right, so they take off. I'll be have eight here. Does eight plus six lethal? How much life do they have here? Yeah, it is lethal. I think we have them here. No, eight plus six is 
now no longer lethal. All right. Well, in that case, I think we um, we'll, we'll freeze this bad boy. And then we'll. I think we block spell here. Yeah, it's the second time they do it. I mean, they've done so many things that, like, kind of disrespect the competitive scene. It's unfortunate. But it's, it, it's, it's, you know, it's kind of, unfortunately, the norm. Do I have lethal here? Oh, now I have super easy lethal. Don't have to calculate. Feels good, man. Chat, I'm having to play against frickin' quest priests at top this legend. This is very good for me. Alright. When is the big jump? Should I probably have to end the stream soon? Probably like a few a few more games. Giga favored versus shaman? Dude, what if you can't see your opponent's hand, Mr. Huang? Is it still Giga favored? <laughs> Cause that felt pretty easy for me. <laughs> Chat dude. <laughs> dude, dude. <laughs> Daddy go. <laughs> five four five wins okay Ooh, is nails i bet nails is actually playing warrior do i keep brucon do i go full greed here oh it's so greedy it's so free so all right sick <laughs> I mean, our hand's insane against Warrior. It's only meh against. The Nail is a very good player. He's a very good player. It's, it's weird, like. I know like lots of the players, at least in the Americas region, some of the EU who are like insanely good players, but like no one outside of the competitive scene knows, like I, not many people know about nails. You know what I mean? Um, I mean, just temple flare I don't need, I don't need the value. The nail is a very good player. Chat, control warrior or charge warrior? Control warrior, I think, is super free for us. Charge warrior is a little bit harder because they could scam us, right? Is that music's name? Uh, this is, uh, let me find the name of the song. I'll tell you the name of the song. It was, uh, all right. Oh, crap, it's annoying to copy. Copy song link. All right, here's the song link on Spotify. There you go. Ooh, dude, Nail's running the freaking the five head tech over there. Ah, dude, this blocks me from freaking. All right, whatever, we're fine. Let's do this.
Am I getting shield shattered for two minions here? Wow, he's shield shattering for two minions here. Chad, I think I could just go for a, a Mutanus win condition here. So I could go like Bolner this and like play a million minions and get Mutanus down this turn. Chad, what do you, what do, you do? Okay, I, I, I'd rather just set up and then eat three minions next turn. And just that seems like it's just always winning, you know? <clears throat> like how do the probably don't know about the players who already qualified for worlds already yeah all right Oh, he's playing Weapon Warrior over there. I don't really need Murloc discounts at this point in the game. Let's take Cookie. Let's go. Ah, dude, did Dave just gotta come say hi, dude? Did that no hands gamer? Dude, I wonder if somebody will that will eventually happen. Eventually, someone will see me out at the sex cult and will be like, "Wait, is this what the sex cult is?" And they'll be like, "Like, yes." How does he win without Galvanger or, I mean, maybe just more and more weapons, but I have like infinite Bolner values or so, Brucon value, I mean, so it's probably tough for him to win. So I don't really have any good high value battle cries anymore. I could, uh, I could generate something though, right? Chad, oh, do I ever, is it, is it right to amalgam my own amalgam or do I go for elementals? I could hit the Colossal Minion, but, ugh, okay, he's doing this, all right. But uh, Murlocs, I could hit another Mutanus, which could be nice. I'm not sure what's right. If only I had some warm soup. East Colossus. That might have been a good play, actually. I have a lot of cards to draw. I think I'm going to take the Gorlack here. Because I might not draw them for a while. Wait, I didn't actually have that many of them to draw. That might have been stupid, chat.
I don't know. I guess I, so what do I have by a big value? I probably should have uh, gone for a beast. I don't know. I'm kind of, wait, do I have any good battle cries left? I have Snowfall Guardians. That counts for some, then if they ever... I mean, can he win with weapons alone against my hero power? Ooh, that's not good. I don't have a Snowfall Guardian. I still haven't drawn a Snowfall Guardian, which is kind of crazy here. Let's see if he just, is he just trading everything off here? He is, okay. Uh, he might win me over here. Yeah, he's, I mean, he's running double treasure guard. He might just run out of stuff. So I have to kill this eventually, though, but like. Like, he can't run cause, so like, I might win in fatigue here. Wait. Dude, is he. Dude, he can fit it cause in this deck? Oh, he is running cause. All right, dang it, dude! I'm losing. The Chad, I ate so many things, and I'm still gonna lose. That sucks. All right, I think I think I lose. Unfortunately, I guess I start f doing lots of freezy boards here. I think that feels right. I guess I can try and hit like a schooling here, maybe. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. I think I lost this game. Damn, I thought we were going to win. I don't know if I... Uh, fun I might have fundamentally misjudged this, but... Let's see. Do they do the cosplay here? Cosplay. Wow. Joe, do I ever have lethal? Wait. Oh, here comes the Rancor. Damn. I could do another board freezy play, though. Kind of make their day uh, awkward here, right? Do you run Brawl? Probably. I mean, maybe he doesn't, like, what is he not running? Like, how does he have all these, like, different cards? I guess not having double from the depths really makes the, and Nelly makes the deck have a lot more options. Hmm.
if only I had some warm soup. I screwed up there. Actually, doesn't matter. All right, my chat, if our Glug wins this brawl, I think we win the game. Nah, you jerk. Looks like he wins. Look at your joyous. I mean, <laughs> Rattle Gordon mode, I think they are under control. I mean, dude, like. Chat, how many of you who watch my stream regularly go into other people's stream and be like, so like, no hands gamer, isn't he the best player ever? You know? <laughs> like, I, I just think he's the best. You know? Like... Did it. All right. So they got a pretty bad low roll here. We got to give them another low roll. Oof. Mm -hmm. So I could do it every shit at once. <laughs> Ah! Did did nail did uh the Chad? I ate like half their deck. How did I lose this game? All right, I think I'm gonna end the stream chat. I'm, I'm, uh, I gotta. It's like a long bike ride. I gotta get ready. I'm gonna give myself like 30 minutes to get ready, eat some food. Oh, chat! I have to. No, I have some chicken. I have some chicken I can eat. So, uh, yeah. So, I'm off to a sex cult. It's a long ways away. It's like I, I could, I, I might take a bus, but. Yeah. Chad, dude. Chad, did we raid uh, Meat Man 